Thanks. Okay, um, so if you saw my last video, I showed you how to put action replay codes onto the R4. And now I'm going to show you how to put Pokey Save on the R4. This is for when you have um, um, a Pokemon Diamond or a Pokemon Pearl game. So you can use that. Now I'm going to show you how to do that. <coughs> okay, so first you have to put your um, memory card into the micro SD then on your computer. You should get this. You open it and then you go to your system file <coughs> and then on the on Google type in PokeSave then you're gonna download it on the page and then you should put it in your system file once it's finished you open it and this is what you should see Okay, so open your Pokemon Diamond or Pokemon Pearl game. You go to open. Here are all your games. Go to the game section. Find Pokemon Diamond. And then go to open. Then all your Pokemon and your scores and ID are all here. Okay. And you can um, edit here and do whatever you want. And I'm going to show you um, Pokemon that you can put in the um, in your PC box. Yeah. Okay, to go to your PC box, you have to go where it says storage and then press edit. And here are your Pokemon um, in your PC box. Okay, so um, this box is already full, so if you want to change your box, just um, Change the number over here. Okay, um, so I go to box three and where it says none, that's spaces where there's no Pokemon. <clears throat> okay, so then you have to go to edit, and here's the whole section. <coughs> okay. So, to start off, you pick your Pokemon over here. You could get any kind of Pokemon you want over here from A to Z. Um, I don't know, I'm gonna just pick out, I don't know, Absol. And you could, over here, you could put any item you want. I'm gonna pick. Let's see. Um, I'm not sure there's many kinds. Let's see. I'm going to pick a max potion. Okay. Over here there's a trainer ID, secret ID, level, etc. You could put in any level you want or anything you want. Like. 100 or something. Um, there's other stuff you can put in, like you could put a nickname for your Pokemon or like a ball that was um, caught with it. But it depends. It doesn't um, you don't have to 
put all this stuff in if you don't want to. Put it as a male or female. It's, uh, let's see, Pokeball. Over here you can put the moves. I'm just picking any kind of moves, I don't really care, I'm just showing you how to do this. Okay, so once you have these moves now, um, this is how much BP left, those are power points. Uh, just change it up to seven. Okay, um, here are all these ranks, you could put it as complete. You can make it have Pokey Ross. Okay, so this is just an example of it. And yeah. Okay, so once you're done with that, right? Uh just press OK. And your Pokemon is right here. Once you finish with that, just press OK. Then press save. Once you press on that, your micro SD card will flash four times. And then cancel. Okay, so now you can safely remove it from the computer. And I'm going to show you um, the code. Okay, once you get your game started, um, you go to the Pokemon Center and go into your PC box. Go to withdraw Pokemon, and here's your Pokemon. An absolute level 100, that's a female. Okay, and then go to your summary. And as you can see, it has Pokeros um, over here. And let's see. Also, the item has a max potion. Um, for this, I didn't put it in the Poké Save, so that's why it doesn't appear on it. And here are all my Pokémon's moves. Seven out of these numbers. Okay, so um, that's really about it. Um, I'm gonna try to make some more. I'm gonna try to make some more um, Pokemon Battle Revolution walkthroughs. I also didn't do that in a long time. Um, I'm trying to do that though. Okay, so stay tuned for more videos. Thanks for watching.